Hi, this is Rich, the Engineer of Muni, PPA Board Member and Kentucky State Director, with this week's update on the fight for poker rights. I'd like to thank everyone who participated in the Poker Money Bomb. It was a terrific success. We eclipsed our goals. Now we're even more sure our voices are being heard loud and clear on Capitol Hill. Which brings me to the second point. You probably heard about the legislation in California. It was not player-friendly. I'm proud to say we're strong enough now that we don't have to take whatever comes down to pike. We're not going to have poker imposed upon us. We're going to be a partner, and the poker that we do get will be to benefit the players. As a result, we did formally oppose the California legislation. They were not able to win without the support of the player base. That bill did go down in flaming defeat. You can count on PPA to stay on this to encourage the backers of the bill to include the needs of the players in the legislation. And that brings us to the most important fact of the day. The Unlawful Internet Gambling Enforcement Act went into full effect on June 1st, and yet here we are still playing. All the sites are still readily available. There's even money heads up. Not everyone's solid. I believe Congress will have to revisit this and make some adjustments on what they did. When they do that, you can count on PPA to be there. You can count on our concerns being heard. And you can count on the fact that we're strong enough this time to put up a really good fight if they try to make it worse for us. So poker players' concerns will be heard on Capitol Hill. There's one way you can be sure that our concerns are heard on Capitol Hill is to ensure you're writing to Congress. Don't forget to visit the ppa.org slash take action and just make sure you send the two letters and make sure they hear from us. After that, please try to give them a call. If you haven't called them this month, just pick up the phone and let them know, you know, your law has failed. It's reverse protectionist. U.S. sites are barred, yet foreign operators are protected from that competition. It's time to have an open playing field to benefit the player base. So I urge everybody to give Congress a call. Call both of your senators, call your congressmen, and let them know you demand your liberty. Thank you very much.